Hello everyone, today I'm at Shanklin Station on the Island Line and today I will be travelling up to ride and coming back down stopping at a few stations on the way uh, not all the stations because I'd have to wait there for an hour but um, first time visiting the island with the new trains uh, last time I came here was about two years ago to see the older 1938 stock but as you can clearly see the, the uh, track has been raised and the platforms have also been uh, raised sorry the track has been lowered platforms raised but, uh, apart from that Shenkland station hasn't changed much which I quite like really nice station you can clearly see the other platform over there I'm not going to zoom in because my zooming skills are really bad but um, but my train's only going up to ride Esplanade today I'm not sure why but I won't be filming the pier I will be getting off at Ride St John's Road and Braiding because Braiding is the station with the new passing loop so I want to see that and film that but uh, but yeah first ride on these new trains the unit will be 484 yeah 484 today it's the only one running all day apart from in rush hour when 004s uh, brought in to help with the commuter services uh, But yeah, it's an hourly service at the moment and I can't wait to film them Goodbye from Shanklin
So here we are at Ride St John's Road now. Journey was good, pretty bumpy, but that's expected on this line. Um, yeah, we have a few Island Line trains here. I got off of 484005 just now, and in the bay platform here at Platform 3, little used, but it's used once a day, I believe, on a Shanklin to Ride St John's Road run. Uh, it's 484004. That this one only gets deployed for commuter services, I believe. And then over here we have the depot. We have 002 and we have another unit behind that, I'm not sure. But I know one of the units is definitely in the workshop just there. Uh, so three out of the five units are here in the depot. And at the moment one of them is in the operation uh, on the line up and down here. And then one of them's in the shed. So. You can clearly tell how much they've uh, raised the platform there. Probably about at least 30 centimetres. Uh, doesn't look like they've re replaced the track here. But um, you can tell they've repainted a lot of it. And yeah, I was due to go up to Ride Pier Head instead of here, but my train only went as far as Esplanade. They do that every three trains. It doesn't, they only go to Esplanade, so at the end of the pier, so. I will go to the pier at some point later on though, uh, but but yeah, my train is due to come back in about 10 minutes uh, for our next stop, which is Braiding. Here we are at Braiding, our final stop of the day. You can see it has a 
brand new passing loop. Really nice and refurbished, you got the signal box over there. We have a train coming in. Just gonna film, it's not our train. Our train's about half an hour. Um, but yeah, really nice station, very quiet, nothing much around. But yeah, train's coming in. Sorry I didn't uh, film uh, me getting out of the train just because I wanted to get a picture of the front. But yeah, this is Braiding. Next stop, Shanklin. See you in a bit. So I'm back at Braiding. Uh, just gone and got some lunch at the local shop. Not much, not much here at Braiding. Uh, a couple of pubs, a church, and some very small shops. But got my lunch from there. But uh, just going to show you the timetable here. They uh, link up the train times to the pier with the ferries. Um, so not all trains actually go to the pier head. Mo a lot of them do only go as far as the Esplanade, which is the one I got on. Uh, you've got Monday to Friday, Saturday and the... Sunday train times. Uh, the island line is operated by Southwestern Railway, so it's all Southwestern Railway themed, but that is still a nice heritage vibe to the place. Just going to try and zoom in here. Uh, yep, reading station. Really nice station. I do recommend coming here as the new passing loop's been installed. Um, on the island, that in uh, rush hour, there's two trains um, in each direction every half an hour. Um, <clears throat> while in off-peak times, there's just one an hour, so there's one train which just goes up and down uh, the whole line in off-peak. So there's two trains. So it's half hourly service in mornings and afternoons and in, during the midday uh, off peak times it's just uh, one train an hour which is I feel like it's not really enough personally if, I, if you'd like to go train spotting here but um, it's alright when you've got stuff to do when you've got your phone to go on but, um, but yeah Braiding Station really nice one my favourite one on the island I think. I would recommend a visit here. You've got a temporary footbridge behind uh, this uh, this black one here because that one can only hold one person at a time. You've got a temporary one behind that and obviously here you've got the signal box which has open days on I believe Monday, Wednesday, Saturday and Sundays and also every bank holiday it's open. So yeah, that's really nice, nice signal box. I'm going to try and, try and go here actually if I can, try and have a look inside. But uh, there used to be a platform here, believe it or not. Uh, back in the... Well, back before beaching happened, really. Got a big whistle board over there. But yeah, there used to be a platform here. You can tell because of the... Um, the uh, building design. So, yeah, this is Braiding Station. And when my train is due to arrive in about three minutes, heading straight back to Shanklin, not stopping at Sandown or Lake. Or well, I'm not stopping there, the train is. But... Um, but yeah, on the footbridge there's lovely views of the island. So I'll see you on the train.
Sit down here, yeah? Yeah. So we have arrived back at Shanklin Station after a good bash on the island line this afternoon slash this morning. Uh, but but yes. Uh, probably gonna just gonna film this one to part. And then yeah. So thank you very much for watching this small mini vlog. I'm not sure what I'm gonna call it yet, but something along those lines. Uh, but I'll film this one to part for Ride Peer Head. So thank you very much for watching this video. And um, thank you for joining me on the island line. <laughs>